Okay, so I said I'd do daily vlogs again, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm incredibly tired today, and I'm very fatigued. Uh, I've had real bad sickness um, today, and like really, 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 really under the weather. Um, I set up a quick little studio at home, so I've got a light here, light here, camera here, and a microphone there, uh, so as I can just record like kind of diary room-esque kind of uh, vlogs quickly if I'm not feeling very well. So today I just really want to touch base on the fact that the chemotherapy is giving me side effects and they're quite bad side effects. Um, the two drugs I'm on are carboplatin and capocytabine. So the carboplatin was intravenous the other day. Uh, I'll put a link to the vlog to do with that in the description. Um, and the capocytabine is a oral chemo drug that I take every day, numerous tablets a day, uh, that is supposed to work in conjunction with the carboplatin. Um, the side effects that I'm getting now are quite um, intense. I've got uh, massive fatigue, as I said before. Um, like tiredness I'm, I'm struggling to stay awake whilst I'm talking right now I am incredibly tired um, and then on top of that I've got constant sickness and it's gone from being nausea to actual physical sickness so it's like a two second warning and then I need to find a bucket or a toilet uh, else I will projectile vomit everywhere and it's not just a little bit of vomit it's like aggressive aggressive sickness um, it's like I've, I'm 32 and I've never experienced sickness like it I've really have never experienced anything like it um, and it, it's just something I've, I've had to get used to we've tried lots of different tablets like antiemetics and like things to stop it from happening but it just it, there's there seems to be no way to stop it from happening, which is slightly worrying uh, and slightly annoying. Um, but it just means that I have to go into hospital and stuff regularly and have checks and then I've had to have blood tests and all this other stuff. I've got infections and things that have happened because of the chemo. And then I've got chest pain. I'm having issues with my heart as well, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. Uh, especially when you're lying there and you're thinking like you're going to keel over, but you're not. It's just your body playing tricks with you. Um, and then, yeah, the the fatigue is probably my hardest thing to get used to because I, ca I can't seem to get past being tired. And I keep waking up every day and I'm thinking, ah, oh, today I'm going to feel good. And I'm like forcing myself to feel good, but I just don't. I don't feel good, um, just don't feel good, uh, but it's part and parcel of what it is and that's what everyone knows the side effects of chemotherapy, uh, there's probably tons more uh, that I don't really realise but these are the ones that I'm feeling like it's a great effect at the moment um, which is which is really annoying but I'm, I'm, I don't really want to moan about it um, because I knew what it would be like when I signed up to do it. So. You know, I've got an emergency scan on Saturday, uh, this coming Saturday, um, because there seems to be potentially more tumour growth. Um, we'll know then on the Thursday after. Uh, I'm in London this weekend um, from Friday. Um, so, yeah, be, hopefully I'll have fun on Friday because uh, it's my brother's gig and Nine Inch Nails, so I'm looking forward to that. Um, I'll be sure to wear a mask and be like, <sighs> I, I could do a Bane, couldn't I? I could be like, Bane! That was a really bad Bane impression, but there we go. Uh, um, <laughs> I really want to do that really funny thing that he does. I'm Bane, Bane, totally insane. Um, but yeah, that, that that's, that's what I'll, do it the weekend um, and then I've got my scans on the Saturday and then the 
doctors again the Thursday after. Um, so yeah, I just want to be well again. I want to be well again. I'm just fed up of feeling like crap. Like, really fed up of it. Um, but that, that's, that's life, um, unfortunately. That's my life, unfortunately, more than, more to the point. That's my life, not anyone else's. It's my life. Um, and yeah, I, I'm struggling with it a bit, that's all. So I just thought I'd make it known that's how it is. But yeah. Oh, my mum and dad as well. They have said that they are going to put their vlog out either tomorrow or the day after. Uh, so someone else is interviewing them. Uh, not me. Uh, someone else is interviewing them and filming it. Uh, so we can get answers that aren't constricted by me being there. So as we can get kind of... I, I think that they wouldn't answer stuff as honestly if I was there. So I'm hoping that this way that they'll answer stuff as honestly as possible. Um, and then put that out for you. Um, I'm trying my hardest to make a really silly intro for their vlog. Uh, just for jokes, really, more than anything. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go because I need to go back to bed. But yeah, I'll see you later. Ta-ta. Bye-bye.